evening, folks. Good to be back with you once again. Now, this week, well, yeah, I was going to say this week, I'm actually talking to you about, uh, obviously, what I showed during the teaser. Controllers. Well, I guess I should show both of them. You know, I, obviously, every, everybody who's ever played a video game knows where controllers are, are and obviously, I, I can just, like, Explain it out. It's how you you control the character on the screen. Actually, I should say the the main character, obviously. Whether it's like I.E. Mario, Sonic, Zelda. Uh, who else? I could go on listing games forever. But you kind of sort of get my get the picture. But. Obviously, you know, I, and I look at controllers, and, and I can honestly say, you know, I grew up in, in the past with controllers. Obviously, one of the, one of my, one of the games that I, one of the game systems, I should say, that I used to play a, is an Atari 2600. Now, now, honestly speaking, you know, controllers have definitely changed from that time. I mean, it. Those, you know, Atari 3600, still my favorite console. Honestly speaking, it, it had the best control. And honestly speaking, I mean, that's all you really needed. That big honking controller. Well, yeah, it was the up, down, left, right, and the one fire button. That was it. That's all you needed. Not like some of these controllers out there these days. <laughs> they've got so many buttons you need a technician's degree to operate look at a Wii, Wii remote for example Nintendo was thinking right keep it simple person doesn't need a hundred thousand button If you need to have a technician, here's the thing. If if you as a company need about 100,000 buttons on your controller, or actually I should say a controller that's to the point where you need a technician's degree just to operate it, that should honestly tell you something. You got too many buttons. Keep it simple. Classic Atari, 8-bit NES, no, 16-bit SNES, yeah, I don't have an 8-bit NES controller with me, I wish I got a dad, be sweet, you know, the original one, you just up, down, left, right, B, A, start, select and start, and that's it, but, you know, uh, why am I talking about all these controllers? And I'll tell you why. In your own personal life, who's holding the controller for your life? I mean, honestly speaking, has anybody honestly ever... Have you honestly ever said, who holds the controller to my life? Who holds the controller for me? I can honestly and truthfully say in a small church in North Park, Maine. April 5th, year of our Lord, 1998. open hand I turn I turn to God and said here's the controller for my life you're in control now 
who honestly has control of your life? I honestly gave my life uh, to Jesus. I literally turned my life over to God. I said, God, you're in control now. You're in control of my life. I'm, right now I pray that each and every person in here that checks out this message hears about you know you know ask the, at least ask themselves who is in control of my life have I ever thought about that God's pricking, you know, your heart up. Saying, I'm willing to take control of your life. I'm willing to do good for you. I'm going to pray. We're going to wrap up. Dear God, thank you for these last couple of minutes that I could sh just share my heart. Dear God, I pray that each and every person takes a look at their life and asks, you know, who is in control of my life? Who holds the control of my life? God, I pray that each and every person takes a serious look inside and, uh, and, ser and asks himself that question on a serious note. I pray each person that listens to this message will honestly give their life to you. And give their control, their personal control for themselves to God, to you, God. I'm, dear God, I'm thankful. I, I, I gave you the control of my life. I don't ever regret it. I thank you. In Jesus' name, amen. As always, I love y'all. Next week. No, actually, I shouldn't say next week. Excuse me. It will be the 14th of May. I'll be back. I'm actually talking about codes. I hope everybody will check it out. Subscribe. I'm like I said. I'll have these messages posted. It'll be up on my site, on both my sites, both uh, web messages on at 16.net and my video game site, Lance394.78.net. Love y'all. I'll see you May 14th, Lord willing. God bless you. I love you. Take care. Bye bye.